Hi there, everyone. This is Mailman Zero playing Low G Man, Chapter 4, Scene 3 Mothership. So, we've got ourselves what appears to be a ship. Um, I'm gonna go down here for science. And you die. Okay. Uh, let's not go down there then. Oh, I really could have used that, too. Um, I guess it was my last one of those anyway. Hey, Tentacle Head. How did you get so different colored? What is this thing, and how can it shoot out like that? Why can't I kill it? I guess I can't kill it. It's indestructible. And it kills me like crazy, and that also kills me. I think I'm going to be dying a lot here. You know, most of the other levels didn't really do a whole lot of that. Of, uh, you know, having pits or anything. Oh, great. I think I just scrolled that guy off the screen. And I just slid right off. Well, game over to me. And we tentacle. And goodbye tentacle. Why does the background fluctuate in colors? I guess I didn't scroll him off the screen, I probably just killed him last time. So how do I... Do it? can I kill this guy? I mean, I'm just dying a lot, that's all that's happening. So, let's not die. It's a good plan. Start off with some useless jump juice, because they put me in this corridor that lets my low G be completely useless. May as well be high G, man, if I'm gonna have this kind of stuff and I run right into stuff, and it wants me to slow down. So why isn't he shooting at me? I don't understand what things would shoot at me and what things wouldn't. Okay, that was odd. More stuff shooting at me that I can't control. Come on, come on! Get out of here! And I'm dead again. I really thought that was the end of me. Okay. And I'm dead again already. Okay, I don't know about this, it seems like the level of difficulty just shot up from like 20 to like 89 on a scale of 1 to 100. No, I've said much nerdier things. <sighs> so the jump juice is actually hurting me because that was the lowest that I could jump. I just barely tapped. And... Oh, thanks. I needed that. I really was... you know, maybe I can just jump past these guys. I didn't even think of that. Oh, I guess it works better to come up here. Then I can get that, come down here, and run into him and die. So, is that... This is actually the boss, isn't it? There's nothing else in here. I just go around there, go to the boss, and that's it. Avoid that at all costs. I can't walk, and I can't jump, and I can't do anything, so I'll just stand here and get hit. Perfect. Alright, made it through there that time. Just come up here, get this. Come down here and get this guy, shoot it a bunch so I can walk through it, kill this, get hit again, kill that, oh, invincibility, that would have been good, and I'm dead again. I'm gonna get this. So I wonder if there's a 4-4, four four, because this doesn't seem like a big enough boss to really be, like, THE boss. You like that? I got a red one and then a blue one right after. So I get for thinking. That reminds me of playing Pitfall on the Atari. Atari? That sounds like fun. Maybe I'll do something with the Atari sometime soon. Oh, see, I got a lot of hits in that time, but it just wasn't enough. It was one of my best runs. So yeah, I was saying that the part at the bottom, when I get there, reminds me of Pitfall when you have to jump across the um, alligators. 
you have to jump just when their mouth is closed. I'm talking about Pitfall on the original Atari 2600. You know, the original game called Pitfall. None of this other Pitfall stuff. Alright. So I think that still the best method here is to probably try to take out as many of these as possible. And... I can do that by doing that, and then I can freeze him, come around here, jump on his head, and then I can get hit by him. Okay, I'll come over here. Then I can get him in a spot where I can jump on him and just wail. Oh, he still hurt me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I really had a good setup there if I'd just been more careful. Okay, well, I'm, I'm getting the hang of this. This guy's not too bad, but now I got some jump juice, which is gonna hurt me when I try to go further on. Oh, and right in the line of fire. Okay, so I made it through there. The jump juice did not hurt me too badly. Okay, that's good stuff. I'll accept some blue. I will come down here and get hurt a lot. Get hurt some more. Get that. Get this. Get him so I can get out of his way. And hopefully... I can come over here, shoot him, and get in some good ones. Come on. I can't go down here, so that was a foolish thing, because I can't see where he's at. Come on, come on, come on. This is my third time! How come he's not dead yet? Okay, this is number four. He's gotta die on this one. Or not. Number five. Come on, number five. And he's still not dead. He's gotta die soon. Come on. How is he not dead? Wow. That took forever. Alright. Yes, that was the end of chapter four. And I think chapter five is the last one. So this could be the end game coming up here. Um... Password, I believe, is Bill. The level's name is Getting Close. This is a short one tonight, but that's all right. Join me next time. Maybe there'll be an extra little bonus surprise tonight. Bye.